Hey, this is Raul of Please Act Right. It boggles my mind when women think men should think like women. This is a cheat sheet to all the boyfriends out there because call me Beyonce, but if I were a boy, I'd be a better boyfriend than half of y'all. So let's get started. Number one, if your girlfriend come up to you and she's like, oh, I'm feeling stressed, I'm feeling anxious, you know, I'm feeling sick, I got a headache. Just shut the up. Don't give her a solution. See what I mean? Men solve problems. That's what we do. But remember, we're not going to argue with women anymore. Just shut the f up and do absolutely nothing. Most of the time, us as women, we already know what the damn solution is. We already know what the f to do. We're coming to you, to our boyfriends, to be cuddled, to feel safe, to feel loved, to feel beautiful. Then why didn't you tell them you just needed to cuddle and feel beautiful? So all you need to do is shut the f up. Ain't nobody asked you to be Mr. Know-it-all talking about, oh, if you have a headache, just drink water. Oh, if you're stressed, just turn to your assignments. Like, literally, know that. We already know that. All you need to do, close your mouth, right? Hug her, hug her real tight, kiss her forehead, and then let her do what she need to do. All right? Tell her she's beautiful, if anything. So basically, she's saying she wants you to read her mind. So how many of us out there who utilize common sense know that that is impossible? to leave her be. And then once all of that is done, life will go on. Everything will be good. Bullshit. <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> That's right, little homie. Because just like she's doing right now, she'll find something else to complain about. More than likely, she'll be complaining that you stopped talking to her, even after she just told you to shut the f up. But if you're talking too much, she's gonna get irritated because we already live day to day getting mansplained by different men we don't even know sometimes. So sometimes it's just nice to have a man shut the fuck up and listen, you know? So you heard it from a woman. Shut the fuck up and just listen. So when she comes to you and tell you that she has a flat tire, just listen. When she comes to you and tell you that her sink is leaking, act like a woman and just listen. Do not solve any of her problems. Number two, if you struggle with your girlfriend being like, oh, I don't really know where to eat. I don't really know what I want to do, stuff like that. Maybe it's because you lack the effort that takes to plan a real date. What? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait. Play that back again. <laughs> Number two, if you struggle with your girlfriend being like, oh, I don't really know where to eat. I don't really know what I want to do, stuff like that. Maybe it's because you lack the effort that takes to plan a real date. I thought that's what she said. Okay, now let me get this straight. If he asks you what you want to eat, where you want to eat, or what you want to do and you don't know, it's his fault because he lacks the effort to plan a date. Oh boy. When I tell you a date can be anything, a date can be anything. See how she's acting like it's so simple? You know, like, duh, if it's that easy, then why don't you just pick a place that you want to go? Man, it's always the man's fault. But it's the fact that there's effort in it that makes a girl get butterfly. And us men get butterflies when you just tell us where you want to go. For example, going out to dinner, be like, hey, just be ready by like six o'clock and I have a date planned for us. It could be Applebee's for all that matter. But it's the fact that you put effort in to choose a place and you know, just take her there as passenger princess and treat her nice. That's what get the butterflies going. That's what get the heart going, all right? You see all the effort they want from us men this coming from a person who can't even put in the effort to tell a man where she wants to go. Or it can be as simple as listening to your girlfriend, knowing what her cravings are, right? And just being like, hey babe, I know you've been craving a pink drink. Do you want to go get a pink drink on this magnificent day? I want to take you to get a pink drink because you're craving a pink drink. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. It's supposed to be so easy for us, according to you but you can't make it easier on us by simply telling us what you want. Say you lack accountability without saying you lack accountability. Obviously, there are more secrets to share, but you know what, Let, let's just start with two and then work our way up, all right? Nope, 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 nope. He should just dump you and hold out for a woman who will put in the same effort she requires from him. And if you're confused, watch the video back in slow motion because I cannot make it more obvious. Oh, uh, no, thank you. Once was enough. So for all the new guys who started watching my channel, this is why it's so important that you check these ladies' social media pages to see what type of videos they're making. This way, you'll be pre-warned on whether you should consider dating her.
this is one of those little knuckleheads that expect you to be able to read her mind and act accordingly. Here's my suggestion. If she doesn't have and utilize common sense, knowing that no one can read her mind, no matter how attractive you think this woman is, she is not worth the headache she's gonna put you through. Because clearly, women like this are from another dimension. This is the dimension of imagination. It is an area which we call the twilight zone. Check their social media pages, fellas. Check their social media pages. Hey, somebody had to tell you, and I love you, so it might as well be me. Don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell to get notified when I post a new video. I post a new video every week. And in the meantime, will you please act right? My name is Raul. See you in another video. So if you enjoyed this video, check out one of these two videos right here. I'm sure you enjoy them too. And if you like, you can visit my channel. I have plenty of videos there. Go ahead. Don't be scared.